What's up guys? All right, so today I'm gonna give you guys an update on the S5. So if you're new to the channel, this is my new 2013 um, Audi S5. Um, well, new to me, I just picked it up not so long ago. I probably had it for maybe a week, week and a half, and I'm gonna show you the mods already done for it. So for me, these are like the first mods I do to a car whenever I get it, just because it makes it look really good. So let me go ahead and start up. The so first thing you'll notice is the front grille. So this is the front grille that comes from the Audi RS5. So I like it a lot more than the stock one because I don't like like all that silver in there and it makes it look a little bit more aggressive. So as you can tell, it looks really good to me. Um, all blacked out, I don't like the chrome outside, I like the full black. So that's one of the first things I recommend doing if you want to your car to stand out from other Audis. And I think I bought it for like 140 or so, and they're not that much. I think it's 140, I'll go ahead and put the links down below. So if you guys wanna purchase anything like that, I'll show you guys where I bought it. This one specifically though, uh, came with the actual emblems itself. I never had one come with the emblem. You have to like use your old one. And when I was taking off the old one on this one, on the old one, excuse me, it broke everything on there. So all those clips were just brittle and cracked. So I'm glad they actually brought this. So I'll be putting the link down below because it's actually a really good buy. And also, as you can tell, I do have a front lip on this car. Um, I posted it in the video before, but I want to go ahead and tell you guys again, this carbon fiber lip from ECS Tuning makes the car look a whole lot more aggressive. It looks lower as well. And as you can tell, it looks really good. It's not the cheapest front lip. It's like 600 bucks or so. So if you want to save up, I would recommend getting this front lip instead of buying other ones and not liking them. Buy this one first and I promise you, you won't regret it. So it fits perfectly on the S5. I used to run it on my A5, it didn't run the best, but this is what it's meant for. It looks really good. So I'll be putting the link down below on that one as well. And while we're at it in the front, I'll show you guys as well, my headlights. So usually there's like an orange, you know, marker there and stuff like that. I personally don't like it. I like blacking that out. So what I do is I take vinyl and I just mark it right here and I just cut it to size, and to me, honestly, it looks really good. As you can tell, it looks all blacked out. The front looks a lot better. Um, to me, it looks the, make, makes the side look wider. Um, the headlight looks smaller. Some people don't like it, but personally, I like it a lot. Like, watch. It looks really good, and then you only tell, like, the silver part. Yes, there are some headlights that, like the Euro, tel or Euro lights, they come, like, white or, like, silver on this side. So, if you wanna go ahead and opt for that, a lot more expensive this right here is like 10 bucks buy vinyl and you have vinyl left over so that's why i did that leading to the sides i have max and design side skirts i'll be putting that video up on installing those later but i have max and design side skirts i think it just plays a lot better with the car because the s5 does come with some little side splitters but i think that just adds a little bit more to it and for me that looks good and as you can tell I did put spacers on, uh, 15 millimeters in the front, 20 in the rear. I will be getting wheels later on, but for now, I couldn't live with like that full gap. They're not, the, actually, they're pretty good, as you can tell. It's right even. If the car was lowered, it would sit perfect. And it sits pretty flush. So 20 millimeters in the rear, 15 in the front. I am getting different tires. Um, these are different you know whenever you go to dealerships and they don't they want tires you just get the cheapest thing so i will be switching them out i'm gonna run 265 35 uh or 40 by 19 so debating if you have tire options go ahead and drop them down below i'd love to hear what you guys say or what you guys run in your car and coming to the rear of the car i did go ahead and get a uh, carbon fiber um, spoiler for it just because it adds a little bit more flair to the back and just looks a little bit more different whenever you're driving. So, to me, uh, it ties everything in. I am getting my diffuser. It just takes a little bit longer to get that stuff in because it's a lot bigger package and not a lot of companies make them, but that's currently what I have in the back. That'll be coming soon. But currently at the moment, the car is like sitting really well. Um, I do have an exhaust on it. I'll be posting another video of how that sounds later on. But yeah, guys, that's what it looks like currently. So I have the spoiler, side skirts, um, spacers. I did put a little, what is it called? Eyelid, a lid, eyelid, whatever it is. Put that in. Um, things for the headlights, the grill, and the front uh, splitter. Um, I will be getting these carbon fiber. Those are coming in as well. And then tires and lowered. 
and the car still looks super clean. I am gonna stick with silver wheels, not these ones, but I will be swapping them out. Um, but so far guys, I love this car. How it drives, how it handles, the power on it. To me, this is honestly one of my favorite cars I've ever had. Um, it's one of my dream cars since I had the A5. Um, having the more power and having like, you know, the S line as well as my S3. I can't forget it. I still have the S3 guys, it's still here. It's quite dirty, I use it as a daily driver and this is my weekend car. So I I'm gonna be doing a whole lot of things to this since it's just a weekend car. I don't have to drive it every day so I can do a whole lot more to it. If you guys have any suggestions of what I should be doing to this car, if you guys like how it looks, please give it a, the video a thumbs up. Comment down below what you guys think about it, what I should do next. Um, like I said, I have those things coming. A um, few more mods, but I will be posting the exhaust clip soon and more like mods and stuff like that soon. But thank you guys for watching. I'm glad you guys are watching me and everybody who watches and comments all the time. Thank you so much. You guys are like the best. I never thought I would have it. S5 and S3 and actually it's a lot of thanks to you guys why I'm able to do this. So thank you guys. Till next time. Peace.